Hi Libra, this is Nayla Latrice and I am here to do your weekly read for October the 4th. Um, so let's jump right in. Spirit, thank you for using me as a vessel and a guide to relay these messages to my beautiful Libras. Spirit, what messages do you have for Libras? What messages do you have for Libras? Ooh. Okay, 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 okay. Spirit, what messages do you have for Libras? What messages do you have for my beautiful Libras? I hope you guys have had a beautiful weekend. We are at the start of a brand new week. Make it a great one. Okay, so we had this come out first. So I feel like you guys are ending some type of relationship, but I feel like it's not bothering you as much as you thought it would. Not saying it doesn't hurt, but I also feel like it hurts. It's almost like you just got to get used to not being around this person. You are used to being around somebody and now you just have to get used to not being around them. But you know that ending this relationship was a good thing that you needed to do. I feel like some of you guys are waiting for them to maybe reach out to you as well. But there's no look. The Ten of Swords wanted to pop out again. There's two Ten of Swords in this deck. We then had this page of swords that pops out and then we have the hanged one. So I feel like after you, you're leaving this situation and now you guys are kind of in a period of um, figuring out what is next. At the bottom of the deck, we have the ace of cups. So that lets me know that I feel there is some type of new opportunity that is going to be presenting itself to you um, uh, really soon. Um, it could be love, but I also feel like there's just a brand new beginning overall that is happening as well. I feel like this is um, spirit offering you a cup of self love. So. Ooh, excuse me. I feel like spirit is saying after this relationship has ended, you need to spend some more time loving on you, Libra. But I feel like um, somebody is paying attention to you. Um, I feel like this person, they're kind of watching you leave in a way. Um, or they, they, they're watching what you do next is kind of what I'm trying to get at. So this relationship has ended and now they still have their eye on you or this could be you watching them as well. You could have ended things with them, but still checking their Instagram, checking their Twitter, checking their Snapchats or whatever the case may be. Um, I feel like you're trying to do it in stealth mode so they don't know you're watching if you are the one that's watching them. Either way, somebody's in stealth mode. They're they're doing it in secret because they don't want they don't want um you to know that they're watching you or you don't want them to know that you're watching them. But I feel like you're checking up on them or they're checking up on you. Mm hmm. And then with this hanged one here, I feel like you're at a time where spirit, I feel spirit has you in a time out. Spirit is saying that you need some time out. <laughs> and it's funny because this is shaped like a T. Spirit has you um, in a place to where spirit is trying to allow you to see certain lessons that you needed to learn from this relationship. And overall, so you're, you're going to be in a waiting period, I feel, before you're able to move on to make so that way you get the messages. That way you understand why you had to go through what you went through. But it's all for your good. But Spirit is saying you need this time to yourself. I feel like for some of you guys, you guys may get into one relationship, maybe single for a month or a few weeks, um, maybe even two months or so forth. And then you jump right back into another relationship. But then the cycle keeps repeating. And then you wonder why you keep getting into relationships. They don't work out. And then you get into a relationship and it doesn't work out. Spirit is telling you to take some time to see what it is you may need to be doing differently differently as well and what you're allowing from these other people mm -hmm. why is ten of swords here spirit why is ten of swords here why is ten of swords here ten of swords why is ten of swords here for my beautiful libras I feel like Spirit is telling you guys to change it up, change up your wardrobe or um, you guys need to have some type of different appearance to you guys 
I'm not going to take this because too many popped out, but we do have this five of cups here. So this lets me know some of you guys are taking this, um, leaving this relationship. You guys are taking it pretty hard. And Spirit just told me that, yes, it's some of you guys that some of it's some of you, Libra, that's keeping tabs on this other person. And Spirit is telling you to stop it. This person was toxic. This person was toxic. This person was no good. It was a good thing that you left them. But I also feel spirit is saying this is a you have a lot of lessons to learn, Libra. And I'm the one that has don't hate me. Don't hate me. I'm just the messenger. Come a little closer. Spirit is telling you that some of these toxic traits that was in this person, you have them in you as well. And that is why you're attracting the same type of people over and over. Don't shoot the messenger. But it's real. Tarot is not always about lovey-dovey and, oh, the love of my life is here. No, it gets down and dirty. And I'm going to be the one to deliver it to you, especially because I'm a coach. I'm a speaker, you know, and it's about getting to the root of the problem. It's about healing. It's about having somebody that's going to tell you the real and Libra, um, this is not for all of you guys, but you know, if it's resonating with you, you really have to take a look within yourself and you have to really do that inner work and you have to heal from within. I'm hearing childhood issues. So you guys have some type of issues from when you guys were a child, whatever those are. It can be a range from the, of, of uh, different things and it's going to differ for each person. But whatever these toxicity, um, this toxicity that you have within yourself, it's not even about them. It's about you. You need to take a look and figure out what behaviors you have and when you learn these behaviors and where you learn these behaviors from. It could have been something that you, you could have been bullied as a, as a child and this made you have certain type of behaviors that you don't realize that you're putting into these relationships and it's a, attracting these certain things. Maybe you're allowing yourself to be bullied. That's a toxic trait. No one should be being bullied, especially as an adult. No. So that's a top that's considered a toxic trait still. Spirit, why is Page of Swords here? And with that Knight of Wands right here, this this person, they were just trying to come in and out anyways. They just wanted to be in and out. They could have been a player as well. But um, it's more so, yeah, they just were not good. Why is the Page of Swords here? And that's why spirit has you on this pause with this hanged man here, because spirit wants you to recognize that spirit wants the best for you, Libra, and spirit wants you to grow. Spirit wants you to be the best that you can be like the army. <laughs> so that's why spirit has you in this time out. Page of swords, page of swords. There's some things you don't see here with this moon card. Because they're in stealth mode. <laughs> like I said, y'all in stealth mode. Why is the moon here? Why is the moon here, spirit? Why is the moon here? Why is the moon here? Why is the moon here, spirit? At the end of the day, you win. At the end of the day, you're the winner. You're the one come out. You're the one that comes out on top. Spirit is telling you to focus on your work. Focus on your work. Focus on bettering yourself and you win. You come out on top. For some of you guys as well, Spirit, it wants you guys to... Um, this person was blocking your, your blessings. You guys have spiritual blessings and your spiritual creativity. And this person was blocking you from being able to, to move forward and to um, realize what your spiritual gifts and blessings are and what your purpose is in this life. But spirit is saying that some of you guys are supposed to be doing something um, creative. You guys are supposed to be trying to figure out what your purpose is. Entrepreneurship, being a leader, a community leader. I was hearing hairdresser or working, doing something something working with your hands so whatever this is for you of course is going to be different for each person you need to figure out what your purpose is and that is what spirit wants you to focus on during this time 
And if you don't know what your purpose is and you don't know what your natural gifts or talents are, you need to start um, just doing different things to just that way, you know, if you like this or if you don't like this, find um, start with things that you know that you are interested in and just go down the list. Right. And say, I like doing this. I like doing this. I like doing this. Could I turn this into a career? Nope. Okay. It's not that. Could I turn this into a career possible? Okay. That's a possible and so forth and so on. Spirit, why is the hanged man here? Why is the hanged man here? But spirit definitely wants you to focus on your money and your career, your purpose. More so your purpose, not money. But um, I feel like you guys uh, putting yourself into your work will, will help you guys, um, will distract you guys and help you guys to get over this person as well. Why is the hanged one here, spirit? Why is the hanged one here? So we have the death card here, which lets us know that you guys are transforming and you guys are moving forward. So again, you guys are going through a period of transformation and spirit wants you guys to move forward. Mm hmm. I feel like some of you guys have been waiting on something or will be waiting on something as well. Waiting on something to come in the mail or waiting for something to come through could be email as well. But you guys are going through an entire transformational shift. Mm -hmm. And it, this relationship is the last straw. Spirit is saying no more relationships like this. Get the lesson this time so you don't have to repeat it again. That way you can transform and move forward. But I feel like you guys got the lesson. You guys get it. No matter how tough it is, you guys understand what you need to do. And you guys are going to do it. I'm confident in that. Mm hmm. Yeah, you guys are feeling stuck, but it's self-imposed. It's self-imposed because there's some stuff you don't see. Again, I feel like it's some stuff from your childhood. Spirit, what is your final message for Libra? What is your final message or advice for Libra? Final message or advice for Libra? I was like, it'd be funny if the Eight of Pentacles popped back out. <laughs> What messages do you have for Libra? What final message do you have for Libra? Final messages or advice for Libra? Ah! I'm psychic. I'm telling you. Focus on your work. Because you're a star. You need to figure out your purpose. Wow! I can't believe that. That's hilarious. I love you, spirit. Thank you. Yes, I felt it. That's what made me say it because I felt it coming. You guys are the star. Whatever you guys do, you guys are bomb at it. And no one does it like you, Libra. So you have to figure out what your purpose is and focus on that because you are going to be so successful with it. I'm hearing celebrity. So even if you're a hairdresser, a makeup artist, you could, you're, it's something with your hands, I feel, but whatever it is that you're supposed to do, you're going to be, oh my gosh, you are the best at it. Okay. So you guys need to really dive deep this week and figure out what your possible purpose is and start focusing on that. It may take you a while. You guys may not figure it out this week for those of you who don't know, but it may take you a little minute. But as soon as you guys figure it out, go run with it. And for those of you who already know what your purpose is, don't allow this past person to block your creativity anymore. Stop watching them. Stop paying attention to them. You move forward in the direction of your purpose because spirit has a plan for you. Wow. You can't make this stuff up. I love it. I love it. I love it. Libra, I am going to leave your read there. Please go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Also hit the subscribe button. If you are new to the channel, we would love to have you added to the family over here. Fam, fam, yes. And if you are interested in diving deeper and getting a personal read, go ahead and click the link down below in the description box. Bye, Libra.